Wakil a community situated in the Tongo Hills in the Talensi district has over 300 caves within the hills, an ancient history and cultural heritage. However, these and the mountain rocks that provide aesthetic beauty are only known to residents. Tanko Mohamed Rabiu took an adventurous journey to the Wakili Hills and Caves and files this report. The topography of the Talensi traditional area is characterized by scattered rock outcrops and upland slopes with relatively undulating lowlands with gentle slopes ranging from 10 to 50 gradients at the Tongo area. The Tongo Hills and Mountains is one of the popular landmarks in Ghana and the Tenzuk Hills and Caves being a popular tourist destination for both local and foreign tourists. Waki is an ancient community endowed with rich traditional and cultural heritage. The community has more than 300 caves within the Waki Hills and has a potential of attracting millions of tourists annually but is yet to be utilized. Men in the community around the 13th century used to hide in these caves for protection from slave raiders. During the World War I and II, the caves served as hiding places for young men who were conscripted into the the British Army. The Waki Hills stands very high up to 300 meters from ground level and one needs additional energy to be able to go to that height. Being on top of the highest hill, one can see an aerial view of Waki community as compared to a drone shot. On top of the high hills, there are lots of plant fields that can be used in the construction of hotels, chalets and other hospitality establishments for the relaxation of tourists and researchers. Jacob Omoboehi used the opportunity to appeal to investors and the government to make good use of the place as a way of attracting tourists to the area. We have so many of them that are not being utilized. And it is not only Waki but the whole of the Tanisi land. We have so many tourist attractions that are not being utilized. If the chance is given, it will open up, in fact, a lot for the, the Talensi traditional area. According to oral history, the caves were host to a harmless tiger who lived in the caves for a very long time, but only hunts animals for food. He explained that there is a cave that links from the hills to the Waki chief palace with a distance of about one kilometer underground. It links up to a tree close to the chief house. And we felt that uh, our forefathers during the First, Second World War, any time they were attacked, they passed through there and come up here. And when they are here and they are attacking them, they pass here and no one goes in. The paramount chief of the Talensi traditional area said there is a traditional development committee responsible for initiating programs and policies that can attract investors to the traditional area and tourism is one of the areas targeted. We have put this committee up to ensure that they look at all aspects of our interests and to see to how best they can draw up a plan for development in the Tanzania traditional area.